Member Oak Bay Gordon Head. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. I move that a bill entitled the University Amendment Act 2017, of which notice has been given in my name, be introduced and read a first time now. Honourable Speaker, I'm pleased to be introducing a bill entitled the University Amendment Act. Universities in this province of British Columbia serve a key role in an economy that is increasingly driven by knowledge, information, and ideas. Academic freedom is a fundamental tenet for a culture of learning to succeed, and a key part of academic freedom is found in the right to participate in the university's governance. While the role of a board of governors is essential to a university, the governance of a university must also be independent. It is with this in mind that I bring this bill forward today. This bill amends the University Act to ensure that appointees from the Lieutenant Governor Council cannot unilaterally set the tone and direction of a university board through having a majority of votes, and that the university boards cannot unilaterally appoint a chancellor for their university. This Act also amends the University Act to change the composition, not the powers, of the Senate for, purposes, uh, for special purpose teaching universities. The current composition of the Senates of special purpose teaching universities gives the administration of these universities the majority vote. This harms the ability of the Senate to keep the academic autonomy of the university at arm's length from government. This bill will bring British Columbia to the same university governance standards employed by the rest of Canada, much of the rest of Canada. Thank you, Honourable Speaker.